one and go. Hey everyone! Oh, I dropped my <laughs> drop the camera. Oh god! That's what happens. That's what happens when you get so excited. You drop the camera. You drop the camera. <laughs> I'm gonna keep that in there. I'm gonna keep that in there, you know. I'm gonna keep that on the YouTube video and the Twitch just for the sake of it. Just for the sake of it. Hey, how are you doing? <laughs> How's it going, everyone? Welcome to the tea time with Mo. I am Mo, and I need to adjust my camera because I dropped it. God dang it. <laughs> That, that, that was the most graceful I've ever been. Just just throwing that out there for everyone. You know, that's the most graceful I'll ever be, ever, ever, ever. <laughs> so, guys, guys, guys. Once again, it's Tea Time with Mo. And I have a very, very special guest. I have my composer buddy who's... Who, who, who made this track that you're listening to right now. And the rest of the tracks on... Tea time with Mo from the beginning of season two. It's the one and only Kaisuru! This side. Kaisuru! Yay! Yosh. He's not only my buddy, he's not only my brother, but he's a um, talented, talented composer. Make sure you go check him out. Soul Eater. <laughs> and a bunch Thank of you. numbers after that. <laughs> oh, wow. Kai. How are you doing today, buddy? I can't complain, Mo. Yo, can't I'm, complain. Man. I'm glad to hear it. I'm glad to hear it. Have you been uh, Have you been uh, up too much recently? Wait, what happened? I said, have you been up too much recently? Oh no, no. Same old stuff. Same crap. <laughs> the toilet, man. <laughs> I love that. I love that. <laughs> That's the best thing ever. Um, so. Yeah, we always start off tea time with Mo with uh, our drinks. I'm drinking um, tea as usual, tea as usual. But I'm actually drinking something that it's called spice tea, and um, it has um, it has cloves in it, which is really nice. And yeah, it's it's Indian tea, but it's it's really good. That gives you that gives you that extra heat, you know, that extra wow. heat. You know, um, and I'm, yeah, I'm drinking from my Konami cup. Oh well, yeah. it's a, it's not Konami, it's it's Fox, Fox Hound from uh, Metal Gear. So, hmm, hmm, that's some good stuff. What are you drinking, Kai? I am drinking some regular old Gold Peak, half and half, sweet tea lemonade in a regular <laughs> blue cup. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers! Yes. I gotta do this properly. Cheers. Mm -hmm. mm. So it's it's a half and half. Basically, it's half tea. Well, let's not call it tea. Iced, gone off tea. To, to as, as, you called it, as you called it, fake tea. Fake, earlier. Okay. fake tea okay. with uh, lemonade. Right? You were saying before. Yes, sir. Wow. I've never actually had that combination before. Dude, but... give it in your life, man. Get it in your life now. <laughs> now, right, right now, right now, during this, like now, uh, okay. Leave the stream and go get some. Uh, I don't know how the, my viewers would feel about that. Unfortunately, you might be waiting here a while. <laughs> That's fine. I'll figure some out. Oh, you figure some out? You gonna dance for us? <laughs> <laughs> Just keep us entertained. That's <laughs> working. Oh, oh, whoa now, whoa now, Kai. They have to pay a little bit extra for that shit. Come on now. <laughs> Can't be on a free show. Can't be on a free. <laughs> wow. So welcome, 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 everyone. Wow. Let's just get jump straight into it. Kai, what have you been playing? What have I been playing? Overwatch, to be honest. Right, right, right. As much as I, as much as I rag on that game being for fear of the casuals <laughs> uh i've been enjoying it recently man i i, I found a i found a, a squad to run with and just been having fun with that man right okay <laughs> like the thing is i i played overwatch as well like when when mm -hmm. it first came out i had a I had a good goal we we played together yeah but you stuck to it i did not <laughs> you know? yeah. I, that's, that's kind of a hard thing to stick with man when, 
The is. salt takes hold of you and, you and you and you lose your mind, man. It wasn't it wasn't the salt for me. Yeah, the games were different from each other. Obviously, with the most multiplayer games, it is. I personally just wasn't interested in it. You know, I I kind of like my campaign. Yeah. Uh, I can't keep playing a multiplayer yeah. over and over and over again. You know, I need yeah, my yeah. I need that's, my fill of storytelling. That's you true. Know? Yeah, that's true. You're right. But this is the thing. This is the thing. And I was looking. Uh, well, I was just on YouTube, as you are, and on my suggested list, there was some Overwatch videos, and I was looking, and this was specifically from Blizzard, and there was actually stories of the characters mm -hmm. as YouTube videos, and yeah. they were really good. They were, yeah, awesome. re they were really, they're really awesome. good. Yeah. And I'm thinking, yeah. why the F did you not put this in the game? Exactly. Yeah. Why did you put this on YouTube? Yeah, you could put it YouTube later. Because Blizzard, Mo. That's why. Put it on the game. That's why, man. I don't... What are you doing blame, to me? Blame Jeff Kaplan, man. I don't, I don't <laughs> you, bro. Who do I main? Dead Z. I main Zenyatta. Baby Ooh, Zen. Zenyatta. Yeah, man. Zenyatta. That one is... The squishy one himself. <laughs> is that the one that, f that floats around? Yeah. Yeah, a little bit. Oh, uh, uh, right, 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 right. The little the robot. Orbs. Oh orbot. yeah, yeah, yes, 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 yes. I remember. I never actually played him. I never played him. Mm -hmm. He was more he was of a support a role, right? Yeah, he was a. Uh, he's a. Uh, he's a healer and a uh, damage booster, I guess you could say. He. Uh, he. He. He'll throw another. He'll, he'll throw a healing orb, and he'll throw another orb that uh, increases the damage on enemies. Ah, uh, right, right, right. I love him. So, do you normally play as support roles? Yeah. Oh, right, okay. Like, in, in almost every, like, every, uh, every RPG, MMO I play, I'm always a healer. Oh, Paladin right. Paladin or, uh, you know, you know. What I love I it. Need, yeah. I love support, man. Yeah. Those, we need those healers and stuff like, we need those cleric figures, you know? Always. Cleric figures. The most important part, man. That's, that's what I'm saying. Part that's, part but part. people think it's the, the least fun part. But it's actually the most useful part, you know? Came with if you're constantly dying, man. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> you need someone like that. And that's the thing, like, a lot of people don't like playing those kind of characters. Because, yeah. oh, you don't get the kills and this and that. You what can still get the kills. <laughs> you can, yeah. They, they like to be one-man so armies and stuff, you know? Nah. Yeah, man. Nah. nah. You, you, need, you need a good old healer. You need a good old healer. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Overwatch and um, well, well, one second. I have to. I have to say. I have to. Someone just mentioned in the in the chat that what you're drinking is an Arnold Palmer. Yes. Oh, okay. So do you drink tea a lot, or this is just like a one-off thing? Oh, dude, I'm from the south, man. You know we drink sweet tea. Sweet tea is in our blood, dude. Sweet fake tea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so, hey, that's that's. that's, that's <laughs> Sweet fake tea. I'm. That's the name. That's. I'm just saying the name. You watch. You watch. Right now. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> over there and fight you, goddamn it. Do you guys? Okay, so let me. Do you guys drink hot tea over there? Oh, I know it's hot as balls are down there anyway. But exactly, exactly. <laughs> but even um, over here in the summer, we fucking drink tea. I do. I, I like hot tea. <laughs> Mm. Yeah, we, we we do love hot tea. Uh, matter of fact, we just went to um, we went to San Antonio for Christmas, right? We went to some uh, I think it was a um, like a what was it? It was a I have no like a idea. little facility with like <laughs> like ponds and and trees and shit like that. But oh, the facility okay. had like a, a tea a tea shop. We got some uh, mango, uh, mango. Oh, that sounds like, good. Something, mango something tea, but it's hot. Mm. We brew that, drink it hot. But uh, you drink I all tea hot. I'm just throwing that out. Yeah, there. yeah. You drink all tea hot, and uh, when it goes cold, you ah, throw it. You throw in the garbage. <laughs> Put ice and lemons in mine, please, and thank you. <laughs> I uh, last week. On the 12 hour stream, I drank iced tea for a donation. Worst experience of my life. And I'm going to do it again this this 12 hour stream. I'm going to pick up 
There's a, you guys have Snapple over there, right? No, sna like Snapple is. Uh, uh, no, Snapple is just a beverage. It's not tea. It's not well, tea. there's, there's. Well, no, of course it's just a beverage, but it says iced tea on the thing. So I'm going to be drinking that for a donation, oh. and I might, I might pick up some of that Arizona piss tea that everyone's talking about. <laughs> <laughs> It's the name. Dude, I don't think it has real like, urine in it, but like you know. Dude, you get Arizona. You get Arizona a, a liter of Arizona tea for like a dollar here, bro. Oh, that's amazing. That's I amazing. mean, it's good, but I mean, <laughs> it's not. You know, oh it's no, not well. A tea like in like in the UK, right? Mmm. <laughs> it's not a thing. It's not a thing. It's. <laughs> I mean, like for me, ice iced tea is just. No, 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 no go for me. But hey, I'll do it for the charity. I'll do it for the charity, right? I'll do it for the charity. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh gosh. Um. So, what do you normally game on? And you just got a new PC, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Just built our our, our rig and it's right here. Matter of fact. Um. Oh. Um. I mainly play on ps4 but uh i'm slowly building up my steam library on on, on pc so i'll be of getting course, into that uh, those steam sales real i'm telling you yes praise god yes yeah they <laughs> lord gaben <laughs> <laughs> they're really they're really really good but uh you can overbuy so quickly on steam sales oh man overbuy man. it's just ugh man. <laughs> no, that's just because. Too. Yeah, just because. I was like, oh, this is for two dollars now. <laughs> I genre you hate, you'll still buy it. <laughs> yeah, never even heard of this game, but I'm gonna buy it. I'm gonna yeah. buy it. <laughs> that's how it well, is, TV, though. Why not? <laughs> yeah, why not? Mm. Oh, this one's about cute girls in cute bikinis, and it's for a, for a dollar. Hell yeah! <laughs> it's like why? You know, it's like. It's it's just that it's too it's a dollar, but the thing with for me, I'm trying to get through the games that I have. I just bought yeah, Horizon. I just bought Horizon. The statue's right over there somewhere, and I, I I'm going to be playing that tomorrow. But the amount of games that I have that I haven't even put into my PlayStation or even to tried on the PC is. It's just huge. The, the backlog is huge. And that's because I get some of the games on launch, play for a couple of hours, and then don't put it play again. Or it's because of sales. There's a bunch yeah. of sales. Or free games from PlayStation Plus, or free games from yeah. whatever. Yep. Like, yep. Guys, guys, come on now. Backlog <laughs> is full. Hell to the <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. I, I just... Uh, I still have to finish... Uh, Final Fantasy 15. Oh, really? I'm I'm barely on chapter five. I've been I've been doing nothing but side quests on there, bro. Side quest after side quest after side quest after side quest. <laughs> I'm on level 53 on chapter six. I'm like, what? <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> and that's the thing, though. That that is the thing. Like, you want to play through these games and get through get the richness of the game and the nar narration and all that kind of stuff, you know. But they they had so many side missions. Must do, yep. That's why I kind of I kind of well I don't really avoid like open world you know single player game single player games, but they just take up so much time. They do a lot of time. Man. They do. They take take a lot a lot of time, and <laughs> it's unfortunate because you want to get from A to B, but you gotta yeah. go and do A. Oh, a, oh a one, a one, a two, a three. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, and that that's why it takes so long to finish some of these games, you know. Yeah, but I'm yeah. I'm in the same boat with you though. Final Fantasy 15, I barely played. Yeah, uh, you know, I've only played like a couple of hours, quite honestly. Oh. Mm -hmm. I just haven't had the chance to play them. I've been playing yeah. Valkyria Chronicles, which I finally finished. Um, oh, okay. Yeah, definitely I'll, I'll, I'll play it too. you should play it dude it's yeah. so good like i know people have been saying oh, it's critically acclaimed and whatnot but until i actually played it and yes it's a it's a strategy game but until i played it i didn't know 
how good it really was and it was it's actually really good i highly recommend it you can get it for yeah. a few bucks now yeah man you know it's i, it's I, really I love good. i love japanese games man not gonna lie heck yeah <laughs> you've been you've been playing a lot of tills though right you said huh you've been playing a lot of the tail series recently right oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i uh i still have to pick up tales of brazaria i finally beat uh tales of brazilia like last month i want to say and uh i love the tail series man tail series love- yeah yeah so we which one do you say is your favorite tales Ooh. uh is that a hard question i think i think zillia zillia hmm. have you tried vesperia no, I haven't tried Vesperia. Apparently, that one's meant to be really good. And uh, my friend, who's in, also into Tales, he told me to start with that one. I was like, okay, mm-hmm. they're not they're not really connected, like they're yeah, like a yeah, Final no, Fantasy. Yeah, uh, no, yeah, none of them, none of them are connected except the uh, like, say they had to tell the Brazilian one and two. You know, mm. like the numbered entries are, are kind of, you know, connected, but. Yeah, it is good. what it is, right? You just gotta pick them up as they come along. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it's the same with me and Final Fantasy, really. I just, yeah. I just pick them up and I try and play through them as best <laughs> my ability, really. Yeah. Uh, so, how did you get into gaming? Oh God. Uh, when I was little, I was like, I want to say, like seven. I want to say seven, eight. Uh, my parents had got me a Sega Genesis for Christmas. Hell yeah! Uh, and the first, I, th- I think Sonic Two came with the system. Oh, and uh, yeah, that was my one first of the game best ever. ones. Yeah, and you, man, you I, can tell like you've got the Sega inspiration with the music that you've written here. You know? Oh yeah, it's like definitely oh, yeah. like the, it, inspiring from those games and stuff. Oh yeah, Sonic dude, Sonic has the like one of the best. Uh, soundtracks and all of gaming, dude. Oh yeah, very iconic. Very Those iconic. guys the Sega team are, are fucking mm. magnificent, dude. They really yeah, are. They really are. So you got the Genesis, and then and then what did you go on to? Ooh, uh, Sega Saturn. Ooh, okay. So you, did you Genesis. go? Mm-hmm. They gone. No, I went from a Genesis to a uh, Sega Saturn to the PS One. Uh, then Sega Dreamcast, then a PS2, then a 360. Now I'm on. No, went to a PS3. Now I'm on PS4. Oh, right, 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 right. Yeah. It, mine's kind of similar, except for I didn't get the Dreamcast. Mm-hmm. Um, my friend had one, and there wasn't many games on it, so I didn't bother with it. I went straight to mm-hmm. from PS1 to PS2. Um, but there was a huge break between PS1 and PS2 for me, so mm-hmm. I pretty much bought. A, I had a PS2 on launch, but yeah. I couldn't. I didn't really play anything on it. And then a few years down the line, um, I bought the slim one, the, yeah. the really slim one, yeah. the silver one. Yeah. Um, mostly because it was on sale, but I was like, okay. Um, and then start playing RPGs over and over again. You know, it's like. Yeah. That was the era of the RPG, I thought. You know, like, there was just so many RPGs on the PS2. That... Yeah, PS2 had, like, the PS2 had such a vast library of games, dude. Like, I, like didn't they have, like, the most games of any uh, console I, I w- ever? It's comparable to the 360, I believe. I'm not sure. Man. I'm not sure. PS2 uh, had, yeah. a they had a crap ton of games. Oh, yeah, dude. they had a butt ton. It was, um, it's definitely one of my favorite consoles, PS2. Definitely. You know, probably my favorite console of all time. Definitely. Um, definitely. But then again, you can't knock the PS1 or the Sega, Sega Genesis or the Sega Mega Drive oh, for us, you know? Definitely. Uh, I started off with some random console, which only had Pong on it. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> That's going back. I'm Damn. showing my age right now. <laughs> <laughs> you know, um, and he only had Pong on it, and he had you. You had these two like little um, nubs that you used to to move the the line up and down, which yeah. was hilarious. Uh, and then after that, I I I went to the Sega Master System, hmm. which absolutely adored. Played the shit out of that, and then yeah. Sega 
Mega Drive and pretty much what you said, like PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2, 360, Xbox One, whatever, you know. It's, um, yeah, it, it's funny how things have changed from the start to now, though, right? It's amazing. Man. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. What is your favorite game of all time? I know, I know, I know it's a, it's a big, big ask there. Oh, oh, <laughs> gotta think about it. You gotta think about it. I know. I can't. Oh, I uh, I personally can't just say one. I I'll probably say a few. Go ahead. I need time to swing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, they all know what I like. They all know what I like. You know, you got your Shadows of the Colossus, and then you got you yeah. know Final Fantasy Nine and Dragon Quest Eight, and all those all those amazing games. I could probably make a top. No, I could probably make. 10 i could probably name 10 that were just like absolutely jaw-droppingly good for me <laughs> i'm gonna you know i'm gonna have to go with uh he's thinking uh, about it's, it it's a, it's a toss up <laughs> between sonic 2 and sonic 3 man oh really and, and it's, it's really not so much the games it's, it's the memories i have attached to oh, the game of course you know? of course that's a, that's what it brings right that's sonic 2 being the first game i've ever, I ever played and sonic 3 uh you know all the times i play with my uh with my cousins and just having a blast and just laughing and and just and just having fun with them yeah of course uh, yeah i think sonic, <laughs> two, sonic 2 or 3 Ah, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I mean, like that's that definitely is a factor, and I think everyone can uh, agree that it's not just the game itself; it's what happens around you at the time right. that can factor into what you're playing. If you're playing right. something that's really amazing, but mm. stuff is going around you that you don't like, you're not gonna enjoy the game. It's just how it is, you know. Yeah. Whereas you can be playing a good game and have have great memories about it we're playing with family playing with friends we're, you know yeah. and that will just make that experience a lot better for you and yeah no I, I completely agree with you like that's i think that's one of the biggest reasons i like final fantasy 9 so much mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's a game that bonds me my brother and my cousin and my friend who were all there watching while we played Final Fantasy IX and we were yeah. talking about it constantly, saying yeah. how good of a game it is and this and that, you know, like... Yeah. And that's what... I think that's what it is, right? It's just the atmosphere yeah. that you build for yourself and how you look yeah. back at it, you know? It's... it's Yeah, I, I completely agree with you with, with, yeah, with yeah. Sonic, you know? Like, so yeah mm -hmm. yeah it's definitely worth uh i kind of want to go back to play them though you know yeah right <laughs> pick up a collection of all old school games <laughs> mm -hmm. i wish i had kept them though don't you just wish that you kept some of the games that you had bro i dude i still have my genesis in the closet over there man oh snap Where's my genesis man oh wow I, I just gotta i have to buy um i gotta buy all my games because um I gotta buy Sonic 2, matter of fact, because I, I let a friend borrow it and he never gave it back. He uh, to say we're not friends anymore, so... Heck yeah. <laughs> I won't be friends if my friends took my... This is, this, is that, this is the thing for me now. I have a no borrowing policy to anyone. You're not allowed to borrow my games <laughs> at all. Yeah. It's a, it just has to happen. I, you can break yeah. friendships like that, though. You break friendships like if someone does like f's up your CD. Yeah, oh, oh, bro. You know. We gotta fight. We gotta yeah, fight now. exactly. <laughs> those, those are fighting words right there. You know, <laughs> if you want to start a fight with a with a gamer, you you bring back their game, Trash not in great. Yeah. Cut you now, bro. Uh -huh. <laughs> I used to lend my my games to my uh, cousins, you know. Yeah. Um. And because they they didn't really have the funds to buy games for themselves yeah. <laughs> but the thing is the games they just i don't know they, who knows like i don't know what what to say anymore it's just they, they f them up so badly they f them up so so badly also i just realized that the chat isn't working on on t time with my okay well 
no, no one's gonna be able to just read the chat now. So, fantastic. Yeah, I don't know what's going. I'll have to try and get that fixed for next week. I don't know. I don't know who's all in here, but I know Desi. Uh, Desi just just yeah, typed yeah. and he showed up to me. No, I mean like on the stream itself. I don't know why. Oh, on the stream. Yeah, okay. I'm not sure why it's not showing up, but I'll try and get that oh, fixed. Sure. I didn't even realize until now. Stream so that's right. fantastic, huh? I said stream problems. <laughs> Hell to the yes. Everyone knows that struggle, especially if you're a streamer. Oh. There's always something. Always something. Always. Always something. Oh, there's no such thing as a perfect stream. Mm -hmm. Anywho, let's get into your music. So you're a musician. <laughs> no, no, no. Mm -mm. You're a musician. Um, yeah. what kind of stuff do you like? What kind of what kind of music do you enjoy? Um, I have a deep love for uh for contemporary jazz or I say smooth jazz. Oh. Um, Okay. Um, I like gospel, gospel music. Um, um I used to. I mean, I still do like rap, but I mean, a lot, a lot of the rappers now are, are kind of trash. Mm. There are like a few rappers that are current, like current right now that I actually listen to. Right. But, uh, um. I've, I've recently got into uh like dubstep, dude. Oh, like dubstep in, stuff and like electronic stuff. Right. Like right. my favorite, like my, my favorite artist right now is a guy named Virtual Riot, and he is a monster. Oh my god, I love his music, dude. Hmm. I love his music. I've never actually heard of that person. So look him up, Virtual Riot, dude. Virtual Riot. Yeah, Virtual Riot. Yep. I'll have to check them out, yeah. Yeah. You was bomb, man. Desi. What? I'm jealous, Desi. What? I always want to go to a jazz festival. Let oh, me have wow. Month, though. <laughs> jazz festival. Oh, wow. That sounds that sounds like a lot of fun. That sounds this like a lot, lot of fun. My, uh, who are my favorite artists? Um, my favorite... I I'll go by by instrument let's see my favorite saxophonists are a guy named uh gerald albright and kirk whalem i don't know much those are much wait no can't forget grover washington jr he's my all-time favorite saxophonist um wow let's see there's another group called um four play like the number four play oh wow uh, like their their uh, keyboardist, their, their pianist is, is is my favorite uh, pianist of all time too. Um, I just love their music in general. Mm. Um, and you say oh, you, you know Gerald you... Albright? Right there, what? Yeah, props, kudos to you, man. I love Gerald. He is a god, man. Yes. Oh wow. Mm -hmm. I, I I kind of. <laughs> I do like the the idea of smooth jazz, mm -hmm. but I can't really name any people. I like the I like just mm -hmm. listening to it. I guess I don't know like the mm -hmm. artists or anything like that. So yeah, I yeah yeah <laughs> I just yeah I mean like I think that's what it is with most music for me. Like I can't I wouldn't be able to name you the the artist or anything, but I would mm -hmm. like the I like the song. Oh, the, the track, yeah, the yeah. track. Yeah. So yeah, so it, it that's what yeah. it is for me. Yes, indeed. Yeah, well. uh, did you say kudos for not saying Kenny G? <laughs> <Dude>. <laughs> oh man, you know I'm a saxophonist, Desi. I'm a fucking saxophonist. I know of everybody else besides Kenny G. I, like I don't, I don't respect Kenny G at all, dude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He just, he's, he's the most known, I guess you could say. But I, I just. He's so bland. He is so bland. <laughs> He's so oh bland. God. Oh wow! I've heard He's of like Kenny G. Flavorless chicken, dude. Oh, wow. <laughs> I, Kenny, I just I can't, I can't rock with him, man. Wow. Okay. Well, um, 
do you actually um so you you say you play right you play the sex of the saxophone and you yep. are you in a band Is yes i am i am in a, i'm in a band with my father and one of his uh long time musician buddies right right, right. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah we, we just had a gig last night at this little tex-mex uh restaurant <laughs> and, uh <laughs> Yeah, man, we, we, we go out there, have a good time, and entertain the people, so. Heck yeah. That's the way to do it. And, yeah. and, more, and it's more so me spending quality time with my dad. You know, I, love, that. I love playing with him. Of course. That's of my course. inspiration, man. That's that's so. it. That's it. Um, it's, it's, I, I kind of wish I knew an instrument, you know, like, I I had a, a guitar and I had an electric guitar, but I never knew how to play them. It was just for like aesthetics. Um, yeah. <laughs> I can play the triangle. <laughs> that's that's my that's my go-to uh, instrument. <laughs> we need wow. More cowbell. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, Deadzy over here uh, is uh, very talented uh, in a few things, uh, singing for one. And uh, she plays the ukulele and stuff like that, you know. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, it it's I didn't know it's. That. Yeah, yeah. Um, instruments wise, I I really did wish, I I had, grown up with that kind of influence. I mean, like we were all, yeah. all into different types of music in my family. I guess, you mm -hmm. know, there was from Bollywood to, like for me, I I was really into like, rock and roll and stuff like that, you know, and all these rock mm. and stuff like that so i i guess i mean like it's just uh, it's just how you grow up right yeah yeah yeah, yeah. definitely yeah. I, I i grew up like like i couldn't get away from music man like my mom would get up on on weekends and, and start cleaning right right, right. Cleaning the house and, you know and she would just be blaring gospel music just all day you know uh my mom, she's a she's a, a choir. Uh, she's a musician for for church. Oh church wow! Musician. Oh nice. Um, so and, and my dad plays sax as well, and so music's in our family. Man, his his yeah. brother, my dad's brothers, my uncles. One of them sings. One of them plays. He's the freaking congas. Um, awesome. They had a band back in the day. You know that was hot around this area. So it's it's all about the culture. Band. It's all it's about the culture. Yeah. In my jeans. <laughs> <laughs> hell yeah, hell yeah, it, and it, it really does help with having those influences, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, like, I would love to hear you sing or, or, or do the saxophone. Oh at God, some point. no. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be years down the line, maybe. But you write Get music that. as well, though. That's the thing. Like, you, you yeah. not only you know you do the, you, from this the music that you're listening to right now, guys is is your creation you know you can hear the that you've been insp inspired by the sega brand and you know like your gaming comes out in yeah it. yep yeah yep, definitely and definitely so you do you you put them all on uh spotify right was it spotify um on, uh, SoundCloud. soundcloud sorry yeah mm -hmm. i get those two, two mixed up all the time <laughs> <laughs> yeah uh, so make sure you go check out his SoundCloud. If you want to post your that link anywhere, feel free to please, Kai. Uh, please go check. It. Yeah, I think it's on under your Twitter in your Twitter bio, right? Your SoundCloud. I believe so. Yeah, yeah, is I it? think so. I think it is. So make sure you go check him out in uh, on his Twitter, and uh, yeah, make sure you go uh, um, and uh, bug him on Twitter and get him to and support him. Get get him to write some music for you for your channels because they can't flag it. It's it's original music original music you know so just thumbs just, up for me just, just give it just give it just give it a go give it a go okay <laughs> so yeah, we've talked that you you know you you've got this love for music and going back to video games what is the most iconic music in a video oh, game oh man oh uh, you know for you personally um any uh any soundtrack for uh for a final fantasy game that is the best absolutely like music in gaming absolutely like hands down in mm -hmm. my in my opinion 
Oh my god, I love Final Fantasy music. Final Fantasy music. Oh, I can god. listen to all day. This oh. it's from from Man. from the beginning to now, the music has been so diverse and mm, different. Yeah. That you yeah. could listen to it all day and you'd be like, whoa, okay, this is from this game, this is from this game. You just recognize it just like that. You know? Oh, I just heard a Sonic. Someone someone <laughs> just got a someone just got a ring. <laughs> anyway. Um But no, it's it's um it's from the wife, okay. Oh gosh. <laughs> She'd be like, sit up straight. <laughs> <laughs> your parents and me, your, your bum. Your <laughs> um <laughs> I I will recommend uh, so, uh, some music from a game that um, is like one of my favorite games, The Shadow of the Colossus. The music is so different, and but so beautiful, and it's written with such emotion yeah. that you be just like entranced by. It. Of course, like for me, because I played the game, I know each where each part of the music will go. But at the same time, it's just it's each piece is different and it's so beautiful. Yeah. It's such a beautiful game and yeah. such a beautiful music track. Um, yeah, of course, Final of, Fantasy. That's a mark of a great composer, man. Sorry. That's a mark of a great so that's a mark of a great composer. Like if you mm. can convey uh, your feelings in a song and, and 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 get people to understand that. That's that's it. You've done your job, right? You've arrived. You've arrived. Yeah. Man. Yeah. And that's what it is with me, like with with dubstep. Yeah, it's a music. It's music to to listen to uh, and mm -hmm. stuff. But there's no emotion behind it, you know. In trance, I feel like there's there's emotion behind it, you know. But like with dubstep and all that stuff, it's just electronic sounds, and that's it. There's no. Yeah. And that's why I I, I will always go towards the old timey stuff and uh, the classical music stuff because. Yeah, that's just how it is. Yeah. That's just yeah. how it is, right? <laughs> it's it's just you just feel that emotion when you f when you hear that emotion in that music, you you feel it yourself. That's awesome, and, man. That's awesome. I love that feeling. That's, that's a feeling you can't replicate with mm -hmm. anything else, man. I would highly recommend you you check out that. Shadow of the Colossus, the theme music. I've heard nothing but good things about that game, man. It's I, a fantastic. I, game. I so always wanted cool. to play it, like when I had a PS2, but I I never got around to. If you still got your PS3, there, there, there is a HD remake. Oh, yeah, they did come out with one, huh? Mm hmm. Oh. It's got Eco and the Shadow of the Colossus, and it's fan fantastic. So good. I only. Bye. I missed out on it on the PlayStation 2, but I absolutely adored it when I played it on the PS3. Absolutely mm -hmm. adored it. So. Check it out. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, so. Do you want to give out any of the. Any of the places that you play, just in case anyone's in town or anything, oh, or would you uh, rather keep that? <laughs> <in> town, <laughs> you don't know. Uh, nobody's coming to a little trashy town. Oh uh, no, but um, we were uh, uh, right now. We are like we've been set to play uh, at this little, like I said, little Tex-Mex bar uh, restaurant slash bar. Um, called sombrero right right uh, we're playing there every week rotating you know between friday one week and thursday the next week and uh we play there we played this other little tex-mex bar in uh in a neighboring city every now and then and mm -hmm. um we just did a uh it's a a gumbo cook-off for the uh, girls haven Gumbo uh, cook-off? Yeah, a gumbo cook-off. Yeah, they uh they were. Please tell me a little uh, bit more about this gumbo. <laughs> <laughs> it was horrible, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, to you. oh, okay. Never mind then. <laughs> I like my mom's gumbo, man. My mom's gumbo was delicious. That shit was like water. Uh, oh gosh, no. Um, but yeah, they they were just raising money and and money and awareness for uh for the girls' haven. Oh, um, nice, nice. That's really nice. Uh, that's and really uh, awesome. you know, that's for a uh, uh, place where, you know, abused and, and, and you know, girls with rough with rough, rough lives can go to uh, get some mentorship and, and, and advice. And, of course, of course. You know, so uh, we did that. Right. You know, like, it sounds weeks like... ago. Oh, wow. Yeah. yeah. That sounds like... Dancing watery go boy. <laughs> it was horrible. 
<laughs> it was horrible, man. But wow. uh, it was for a good cause, though, man. So, mm -hmm. so uh, it was awesome. Well, I'm really happy to hear that. I'm really happy to hear that you went and did that. That's that's amazing, you know. Humanitarian. Yeah. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's just how it is, right? Like everyone knows that I I raise money for charity as well, and my team raises yeah. chari money for charity. So it's always nice to have like a, another charity fundraiser in the family as well. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Gotta gotta pay yeah. forward, right? Gotta pay forward. Got to. You know. Um, Got to. Who else are you gonna help? You know. Humanity is uh, one, and that's how it should be, you know. Um, so okay, so Denzi would will, will kill me if I don't ask this question, because we're all foodies in the gaming industry, right? We're all yes. food. We're, we we love all gamers love food. What kind of, of food do you eat when you when you game? Oh God! Oh, uh, well, of course, Doritos and Mountain Dew, of course. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, um. Shit, um, it it, de it depends on whatever I feel, whatever I feel like eating at the time. Man, I eat all kind of stuff when I'm when I'm game. I really don't really have a specific snack or something, you know, per se when yeah, I'm yeah, yeah. I'm playing. But uh, it's normally it, it's normally chips. Okay. Normally chips, I say. Fair uh, enough. Fair enough. Not Doritos, of course, but. Um, <laughs> uh, I don't know. If, I don't know if you if y'all have um, hot fries out there in, in the UK. Hot fries? Hot fries, yeah. They like you know what okay. Cheetos are, right? Yeah, I know what Cheetos are. Yeah. Okay, well Cheetos yeah. make these makes these chips called hot fries. It's like little, they're the same color as the Cheetos, uh, as a uh, like flaming hot Cheetos, mm -hmm. but they're little, they're they're thinner. All right, okay, okay. Got the square and and they're spicy. It's delicious. Oh wow, wow! That's really cool. I uh, can't say I've tried those before. I'll have to try them good, at some bro. point. I'm gonna uh, send you some. Oh hell yeah! One of these things. <laughs> that sounds like fun. Yeah, it is. We got, we got to come up with my I'm telling you, man. <laughs> I oh. I I do enjoy um. I do enjoy my uh, crisps, not chips, crisps. Yeah. Uh, from time to time, when I play when I play games, um, well, Andy, yo, he did the Andy <laughs> camps. Uh, I like I like Andy camps too. There's the uh, I normally get the uh, the the Cheetos ones though. That's my favorite. I once again no idea what you guys are even talking about anymore. Like, <laughs> I guess I guess that's the that's what happens when you live on two different continents. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I um, I've heard a lot of good things about gumbo and oh, you know cray crayfish boils and all that stuff yes, in the south yes yes you know. yes yeah yes. <laughs> i i have to i have to come and try the, these things out I, I have to make a trip specifically to texas just yeah, for those things <laughs> come on oh wow oh, you got a place to stay man oh look at this he's he he said it on stream guys he can't go back on it now. I'm just oh, saying. Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, wow! <laughs> <It's>... <laughs> <This> crawfish. <laughs> crawfish mode. Oh, right. fine, That's fine. Right. Crawfish. crawfish. Then. There you go. There you go. Even You're though right. it's they're actually called crayfish, but whatever. Crawfish. Whatever. <laughs> in the south is crawfish. <laughs> oh, you, as or, soon or as you go bugs. past that. <laughs> or mud bugs, as we call. Mud yeah. bugs. Mud bug, yes sir. That sound doesn't sound appetizing at all. Oh, but it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh wow, well, nearly fell off my chair. That's how that's how taken aback I was. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, so I've I've heard a lot of lot about that kind of stuff, but I mean, uh, it's just I I would love to try it at some point in my life, but. Who knows? Yeah. Who knows? And hey, if you come here, I will have to, I'll have to take you and Spicy, who, by the way, is Kaisuru's wife, um, is... I'm going to have to take you guys to get some fish and chips. Yes. You know, yes, fish, some authentic fish and chips. Authentic fish and chips, maybe... Plus fish and chips. Uh, <laughs> nope. <Sorry>. Nope. Nope. <laughs> We ain't doing this, Kai. We ain't doing this. 
I'll go all volleyball on you. <laughs> you know? It's just how it is. Uh, but no, yeah, I'll take you to get some fish and chips and I'll take you to some decent restaurants. Like, we in... in I love seafood, man. I really love seafood. So. I love seafood too. I actually yeah, really enjoy seafood. Like when I was when I went to Egypt, because it was uh, um, a a port town that I was staying in, the, mm. they had like this amazing fish market. You could get anything you wanted. What? You could get shark if you wanted, even though it might be illegal there. I don't know. You can get you know a bunch of like crabs you can get blue crabs and all that stuff oh i love crab i love oh, crab. who doesn't love crab mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i tell you who doesn't love crab deadsy doll anyway <laughs> Dead. oh deadsy you messing up man <laughs> oh, man <laughs> oh man yeah um so let's go into seeing as we've just talked about food right food um and we've talked about tea talking about gaming let's go to tv shows and uh movies you like your british tv shows right oh yeah some of them <laughs> some of them <laughs> you've been watching uh certain ones recently haven't you i, I believe on netflix um oh, we, we really haven't been watching too many uh too many uh uk shows recently um mm. the last one we were really heavy into was uh uh dr martin Mm. And uh, matter of fact, we we were we started watching uh, Penny Dreadful on uh, Netflix. All oh, right. And that shit is fucking. That shit kind of freaked us out. But uh, so <laughs> we haven't watched that in a, in a while. So yeah, she got a little bit too intense on there. So huh? what? <laughs> okay. Got wow. intense. But yeah, we haven't really been into too many UK shows lately. We have. What have we been watching? We've been watching Supernatural. Oh, don't get me started on Supernatural. Uh, have you? How far have you got into it? Oh, we're current. Oh, you're current. Yeah, we're so current. So good, yeah. so good. Yeah, man, that is, that I love that show. It's, it's awesome. It's awesome. Yeah. I absolutely adore. I absolutely adore. Um, it is. It's, it's awesome. Yeah, I absolutely adore. The, just the, the storyline. I would love. I would absolutely love a game set in the supernatural universe. Oh, that would be. That would be pretty cool. That would be amazing. Play as the Winchester Boys. <laughs> well, no, you don't even have to play as the Winchester Boys. You can. You can just play as someone that. Is trained by them or something. Oh, Hunter, you know. Yeah. Just drive around the u.s yeah like and just go do stuff like that would be absolutely that'd amazing be, that'd be awesome mm, it'd be a grand scale of things but freaking yeah, heck yeah. you gotta answer calls and go and do these hunts and stuff like that that would be amazing and you could do it with other people oh okay i'm giving people ideas now they're gonna steal uh, my yeah, idea yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> don't show your hand Mojo. don't show your hand <laughs> Yeah, but Supernatural is one of those one of those shows that I, you know like has got like a cult following. Like it doesn't, it's not yeah. net. I won't say right. it's a a popular popular show, but it's got this cult following where a lot of people do still enjoy it and still watch it every week. So that's that's good. I'm glad that they're keeping it up. What is it like season 12, 13 now? Whew. Yeah, they they've been going for a long time, man. Been going you know, long. Sam and Dina from uh from, from Texas. Oh, are they? Yeah. Well, Texas born and raised, man. Oh, really? So, greatness comes from the great state. <laughs> right. <laughs> Already. <laughs> just, throwing, just throwing that out there. It's, it's, it's just a coincidence that you're from there, too. <laughs> I I do enjoy, I mean, like, I do enjoy that show. Um, what else have you been watching, though? Uh, we, watched, we watched a lot of cartoons, man. We some big-ass kids. Mm -hmm. uh, Some anime, I'm guessing. Yeah, yeah. Anime. yeah. Uh, um, um, we've been watching. I don't know if you know. I've ever heard of uh, Amazing World of Gumball. I haven't. No. Yeah, that, that's a show on uh, Cartoon Network. Oh, really? Yeah, it, it, it's, it's it's hilarious. It's real wow. funny. Um, what else? 
we were watching a regular show, another show on Cartoon Network, but they canceled that finally. Mm. But they canceled it, but they, the, the, the series came to an end recently. Um, uh, we were watching Hunter x Hunter. Mm. We watched Tokyo Ghoul. Uh, I've heard a lot of good things about that one as well. Oh, that shit's awesome, dude. Um, yeah. What else? <laughs> of course, Dragon Ball, Super. right? Oh, Dragon Ball Super. Yeah, yeah yes. Dragon Ball Super. Super. We gotta yeah. catch up on that, too. Uh, <laughs> we haven't watched it in like a couple months, actually. Oh, really? Uh, they started uh, putting out fillers, so uh, we, we kind of Womp, womp. Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> I, I hate when do they do that and it's it's more in anime I feel like they do that like yeah. Attack on Titan they could have probably did, done in like 6-7 episodes the rest were just fillers really oh, I'm, wait, I'm waiting on season 2 for that oh uh, hell yeah like, it's coming yeah. out in a yeah, few months confirmed. right I'm like yes yes <laughs> Oh, I can't wait to, to get into that again. Um, but I probably won't watch it episode by episode. I'll probably wait until the whole seasons come the whole season comes out. Because Yeah. Yeah, I'm not I'm not I'm not about to wait a, another week for another episode. You know. Yeah, right. Um, and I gotta right. wait for the dub. I like the dub. Not gonna lie. You like dubs? Well, oh you I like filthy the casual mode. <laughs> You, you I, scrub. <laughs> In the stream, I'm done. No, oh, oh no. This interview oh, no. is over. This is... <laughs> <laughs> wow. I... I thought we were friends. <laughs> no. That's I'm the thing, though. I know a lot, a lot of people really hate on dubs, but that one's actually really well dubbed. It's really well dubbed. I mean... Yeah. There are certain, there are certain anime that are, do really well dubs. You know, like... Yeah. Definitely. Even though I don't believe that these are known as anime, but like the Studio Ghibli movies, the animation, animation anime. yeah, anime. Mm, I think they're two different Indeed. styles, honestly. But the the, uh, the actual dubs are actually really really well done, so I I highly recommend those. Um, yeah, some 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 of them are, are really good, uh, like Dragon Ball, for instance, like we just talked about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome, awesome freaking voice work, man. Of course, Chris, of Chris course. Sabatin and Sean uh, Sean Schimmel, yeah. Hell yeah! I don't know who those people are, but awesome. cool. <laughs> Goku and Vegeta's voice. Oh actors. really? Oh okay. Yeah. Okay. All I dub? yeah. All I know is Laura Ob uh, no La Laura Laura Bailey does uh, yeah Young yeah. Trunks. She does. She does fucking yeah. everything. She, oh, she's in everything, yeah. She does she's everything. In, dude. She's in Uncharted, she games, everything. She like, uh, uh, game voice, voiceovers and shit. Voiceovers, mocap, all that stuff. And she, she plays D&D &D every lands. week. <laughs> That's crazy. She plays D&D uh, &D with her husband and a bunch of other voice actors called Critical in Critical Role. Gotta give them a shout out because that is just amazing. That's the, one of my really? favorite shows ever. On, on Twitch, it they yeah they, they stream it every. What I didn't know that. Yeah, every every week, every every Thursday night, uh, Pacific wow. time, uh, they stream on Geek and Sundry with people like Matt Mercer, who does a bunch of acts, uh, um, bunch of um, what's it called, um, game like uh, voice acting and stuff like that the, he, the right, all right, voice right. The, all the people that are playing in that dungeon and dragon game are all voice actors so it's so good it's so so good yeah that's crazy um, yeah and um yeah you probably see it trending once in a while but it's it's absolutely amazing but yeah let's not go into that because i could talk about it all day yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um uh, what about movies have you been watching anything good Oh man, we haven't been to the movies in wait. Yeah, it's been a while. Oh, really? Um <laughs> Last time we actually went to went to the movies was last I wanna say last year around around like af after Christmas. Like like just after Christmas. We went to go see uh uh Star Wars. Oh nice Rogue One. Rogue One. Yeah, Rogue One. Yeah, yeah, cool. Um, 
Um, and then I think we're gonna go see Get Out tomorrow. Oh, I've heard really good things about that one. Yes, I know. I want to see that shit so bad. That, that looks so trippy, though. Yeah, shit it is, looks that shit so is, psychedelic and trippy. Fire! I need to go see that. I need that in my yeah. life now. I've seen I the actor somewhere now. before. I don't know where. Uh, oh, the, uh, uh, the, the main guy? Yeah, the main guy. I'm not sure where he's from. Not that I can recall. I, I don't know. I feel like I've seen him in a different... Sh- Either a TV show or a movie. I'll have to look it up, but yeah, it's it looks like it's a good, gonna be a great, great movie. Um, Definitely, and and it, and, it, and it makes it even better that uh that Jordan Peele is is the director. You know, he was on uh, you know, you know, if you're you've heard of Key and Peele, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I love that fucking show. I love that goddamn show. Yeah, Too funny. It's it's funny. That's oh, what I've known. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, it's definitely. Awesome. I I definitely want to check that out. I might not go to the theater for it, cause um, expensive. Um, but yeah. Uh, yeah, I'd I'd go. I'd probably watch it at some point when it comes out on yeah, TV. See, do y'all have matinee showings up there, Mo? We do. Yeah, we do. I'm usually okay. at work at that time, though. That's the thing. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. know, so that's unfortunate yeah. for me. <laughs> I gotta go on the weekend, man. And then like they have they have specials out here. Like on Tuesday nights, like it's only like what, like five bucks? What? To, uh, to go, yeah, and like they just like up, they upgraded the uh, the uh, like seating and shit oh. in the uh, central town out here, right? It's like big ass recliners you can sit in now. It's amazing. What? It's freaking amazing. Man. Yeah. Like yeah. you can control, you can like lean back, you can like put your legs up. That's awesome. It's crazy. So we. That's really, really awesome. Tomorrow, man. I, I gotta go. I gotta go see Get Out, man. I we need have, to see it. We have we have a cinema like that as well, but it's in it's in the heart of the city. It's in Leeds. Mm-hmm. Um, and but what you do have the recliners and stuff, and you can order pizza and stuff to your seat. That's crazy. Yeah, they got that's they got really stuff cool. like that in a in a neighboring city. Yeah, that's a couple hours away. Like my my buddy was telling me about that a while back. Like a fucking uh, dine in, dine in movie or something like mm-hmm. that. Oh yeah, it's I'm awesome. like that's some good stuff because they know they that know that awesome. they have to change to get keep people coming in because you got so many so much stuff at your fingertips nowadays. They have oh, no, to yeah, exactly, exactly. You know, they have to they do something. <laughs> yeah, they have to do something. You know. Yeah. yeah. And why not? Why not? You you eat and you watch and that's how it is. That's that's yeah. the best way to do it, right? Yeah. <laughs> um so we are closing in on the end of the show but i do have to i do have one no. last question i know it's so fun right <laughs> 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 i do have one one more question is there any games that you'll be picking up in in the next few months or... well, you know i'm a i'm a very competitive person though so i do uh i love fighting games and that's, that's the rage is fighting real games that my heart the rage <laughs> the salt is real uh, uh. Um, I'm gonna. I'm looking forward to uh, Tekken. Tekken Seven, uh, right? In June, yes, sir. Tekken yeah. Seven. And I'm gonna pick up the uh, latest Guilty Gear. Oh. Probably, I might buy it now. Matter of fact, um, pre-order it. Huh, maybe. Um, I highly recommend that you don't pre-order these yeah. things because they never come oh, on freaking no. time. Oh no! You might as well just go. We don't pre-order no more, man. Mm. We, don't, we don't do that. Sh- me either. Mm-hmm. Well, I did with except Horizon. If, except if it's collector's edition, you know. Oh yeah, that's a different. That's a different Man. thing. Yeah, that's a different thing. You know. Um, what else? What else? Um, oh, Mass Effect. I want. I want to get Mass Ooh. Effect. That, that, have you played through the Mass Effect series? Yes, I have. Yeah. Yes. I started um, with two and then played three. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Me too. Yeah. Me too. I. I enjoyed it. Don't get me wrong. I just didn't know what all the hype was about. Cause mm, I felt like it was, yeah. it was something that's being done, but in a weird way. I mean, I don't know. It's like it's just because it was sci-fi, I guess. I'm not a huge too. Mm-hmm. I'm not too big of a fan of of sci-fi, but you know, it's 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 Mass it's cool. It's yeah. pretty pretty darn good. Now, uh, I'm looking forward that. to it myself, you know. But I don't know if I'll pick it up on launch. <laughs> um, so any anything else besides Mass Effect? Ooh. What about that? Um, was it 
Is it Marvel versus Capcom or something like that? Oh yes, Mo, yes, Marvel, yeah. yes. Marvel, when's Marvel? Marvel. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Marvel, baby. Yes. Well, whenever that comes, it'll probably come out next year. Most likely, knowing, knowing, knowing Crapcom. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll pick that up, definitely. That's day one. Day one purchase, dude. Heck yeah. That sounds you gotta like... have fighters. Yeah, you love your fighters. You love your fighters. Did you ever gotta play have. in like tournaments or anything? I want to go to a tournament. I want to go so bad. Mm. Like they have one called Texas Showdown in uh in mm. Houston. Like so Houston's only like a couple hours away. Yeah, yeah. If you do the speed limit, but uh. Yeah. Um. Well, so you so you've never played in like a tournament before? No, I've never. How is that even possible? Like you're 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 such a competitive player. And like it, it, it's so it's so far my car is kind of shitty. Ah uh, so right 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 there. right. And the thing is for me, I'm not a competitive player, but I've played in a freaking fighting game tournament. Yeah. Yeah, I played in one, and I was amazing at it. I didn't never played that game in my life. Mashed the buns as best as I could, yeah. and I won. <laughs> Mash away. <laughs> and I won one round. Okay, thank you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it was Soul Calibur. One, like if they had, like if we had a local scene here, I would be at that junk every. I'd be at there every weekend, dude. I'd be there every weekend. <laughs> if I lived in Houston, I'd be, I'd be in the tournament every, every year, man. So it just, it's just a little <laughs> far. And then, like, then you gotta, you gotta get there. You gotta get a hotel and, 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 and you know, show up on time and. and be there for pools and, and all mm, kind of other shit. Mm, mm, it's, it's crazy. I think. But I want to go. I, I definitely. I'm gonna go before before yeah. I die at least. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think what what you should try and do is try and go for a local tournament first. Maybe maybe do something like that, or maybe try go for, um, you know, when if you go to like a convention, they have tournaments there. So you, you should you, you definitely. You don't have local out. tournaments or conventions in this little crappy city, Mo. <laughs> but the, don't you have Pack South? Pack South is in uh, where's Pack South? Is it in San Antonio? I believe it was in San Antonio last yeah. year. I think. I think maybe. San Antonio is that far away from you? Somewhere far away. Yeah, it's oh, far. okay, never mind. Yeah, San Antonio is like I want to say it's like about four four hours. Four oh hours snap! Away. Yeah, it's pretty okay. far. Three, four hours away, so. Dang. Dallas, too. It's, it's closer than me. Yes, <laughs> it's but, closer than me. The biggest tournament that, it, that they have here is Texas Showdown. And that's, a, that's only a couple hours away. I, ah, I okay, could okay. make that, you know, but I never know if I'm going to, you know, work, have to work or. Ah, uh, right, 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 right. Okay, so. okay, okay, okay. Well, I think you would win it. I think you would win it. Oh, shh. Sh I get bodied real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I get bodied. This is the best way to do it. Fake it till you make it. You just talk shit to everyone and then they just, you know. That's what I did. That's what I did. I was like, I'm going to kick your, all your asses. Now come at me, guys. You know. And then I got wrecked. But, but still, you know. It made it entertaining at least. <laughs> anyway, I've finished my tea. That's some good tea. Have you? Uh, how, how, how far have you finished yours? Have you finished your tea? I'll finish it right now. Hold on. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm, okay. Mm -hmm. Chug, 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 chug. <laughs> no. Yeah. Let <laughs> I me mean, not break anything. My wife will kill me. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, um, thank you for coming on. I've been wanting you thank, on for such a long you, time. Thank, thank you, Thank you for having me, my friend. Of course, of course. You know, it's, it's been a... I've known you for yeah. a while. I've always wanted you on. And I'm just glad our schedules have aligned and got yes. you on you know that's yes. that's that's the main reason we haven't been able to do this is because schedule yeah man. scheduling life. is difficult life is difficult Adulting. <laughs> <Ugh>. responsibilities <laughs> no thank you <laughs> <laughs> so guys make sure you go check out kaisuru even though he doesn't stream very often he does stream so go check him out on Twitch, which is Kaisuru. I've written it on the stream right there. And there is, um, and check out his Twitter, which is Soul Eater uh, 2K6, right? Yes, sir. Yeah, 2K6. And check out his SoundCloud. He's got some really good music. You can find this, this um, mix that he made 
on SoundCloud so you can listen to this. If you love the music, go for it. I highly doubt, I highly recommend that you go check him out. And if you need some music written for you, he's right there. He'll do it for you. He will help you. Let him help Come you. Come hither. Come hither. Come hither. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this, Kai. And I will catch you all later. Bye, guys. Peace. <laughs>